Greetings, old computers enthusiasts. I wanted to show you all my Tandy 1000 computer. It's, I believe, the original model of Tandy 1000. It's rather old. It runs an 8088 microprocessor. And I figured out how to display it on my newer monitor using my computer's television card. Okay, let's begin by starting it up. Big old toggle switch. Starts off checking the memory, checking the disks. Then we go ahead and insert the operating system disk while it loads. You don't want to leave the operating system disk in the machine when it actually starts because there may be a large impulse of magnetic fields hitting the disk when it turns on and that destroys your disk. Okay, if you want to get a good view of the keyboard, the unit itself. Now I'll just zoom in on the screen for your viewing you pleasure. And Okay, first thing it does is it asks you the date because it doesn't know the date. I think either the battery and the system clock has gone bad, or Tandy just didn't build in a system clock that remembers. We'll just go ahead and enter in January 5th, 2009. And now you're brought up to the DOS prompt. Not particularly exciting. But we can do such things as see what's on the disk. If you'll notice, there's no really directories. These disks don't hold very much. There's actually so much stuff on this disk that we can't see it all at once. You could use the more program to uh, see what else is there, but I don't want to do that quite yet. Okay. My system has the benefit two drives. Let's look at drive B. And we see that on this disk, also notice how slowly it brings up the directory. It has to read this really slow old disk. I have a basic interpreter. Basic is a programming language. Let's go ahead and run one of my programs. Oops. Not good. Okay. For those of you familiar with HomestarRunner.com, you will appreciate this song. It is the Trogdor song. And that's it. It just brings up the basic interpreter. It's not a terribly sophisticated program. That's that. Okay. Some other programs I wanted to show are a more awesome office program. Electric pencil. Very early word processor. Let's just see what's on the desk. I don't remember the command name. Okay, this actually isn't electric pencil. But I have a lot of disks. This may hold it. Stinks not having a hard drive. Okay. All right, pencil. Does not like it. Let's try that again.
Okay, I don't seem to be finding it. No bother then. I'll just finish with the finale. Again. Let me show you the color graphics here. I remember this file name. I'm going to play Space Commanders. He just happened to me. Notice how quickly it loads text. We'll just go ahead and start the game. And this is just your run of the mill Space Invaders game. I'm not going to play it very well because we don't have that kind of time. Anyways, it's a game. The beauty of this, and I find this really funny, is to quit, you just hit Control C. No commands. Okay, that's it. Let's turn it off. All you do is we back out here. All we do is flip the switch. If you want a closer look, and last time, handy one. Thank you.